Hey everyone, it's John Reed, author of 50 Things to See with a Telescope. Welcome to the Homeschool Astronomy Challenge series. In this video, I'm going to introduce you to dark skies. This is Learn to Stargaze. You really only need two things in order to stargaze, a cloudless sky and well, stars. So what, might you ask, is preventing people from seeing the stars? Well, for one, the sun is up for half the day. In winter, the sun sets in late afternoon, and it gets dark pretty fast. But in the summer, even after sunset, because we're tilted toward the sun, it takes a long time to get dark. Then there's the moon. When the moon is full or nearly full, only a small fraction of the stars are visible. If you're a stargazer and the moon is up, the best thing to observe is, well, the moon and any planets. Forget about the stars. And finally, sky glow. Sky glow is primarily the result of city lights illuminating the sky and obscuring the stars. Sky glow that's caused by humans is called light pollution, which represents a ton of wasted energy, harms migrating birds, and disrupts many nocturnal species. To learn more about light pollution and how you can help, visit www.darksky.org. A dark sky is a glorious thing. You'll see thousands of stars and you'll see our Milky Way stretch across the sky. And if you're using a telescope or binoculars, it's much easier to see galaxies, nebula, and star clusters only after twilight and when there's no moon and when you're away from city lights, do you actually have dark sky? To find the dark sky nearest you, go to www.lightpollution.info. Find your current location and note the color of the map. If you're following along in the 50 things to see with a telescope activity workbook, we're on page 18. Dark blue and gray represent places with dark skies. Red and white, those are the least dark skies, and the green zones are somewhere in between. So here's your challenge. Find the blue or gray zone nearest you where there is a park or a campground, a place where you can see the stars. Then get to those dark skies on a cloudless, moonless night and have a wonderful time stargazing. Thanks for tuning in. Please subscribe so you don't miss the next video. And remember, the future is looking up.